Hey, welcome back to Minecraft through the night. I'm doggone. Man. Okay, well that was a late night. Uh, we were okay. We survived. How's our armor doing? Oh, that's right. We got the new steel armor. It's doing fine. Everything is fine. Uh, okay, that's that's cool. No llamas attacking us. I, dog, why are you going up? I. Cool, we cool llamas. Why when llamas attack? Doggone Chronicles. We cool. Hey, we're not cool. Dude just spit me. Oh, there's something that's uh hey, Frank, you ready? Ranger zombie. Why are these llamas? I'm getting a little bit tired of this, man. Look at that. Frank, you ready? I've never killed a llama before, but. Get rid of this DNA. This hyper aggressive hyper llama DNA is wrong. Let's get get rid of it. Eugenics with dog. Oh, that's terrible dog. Why are you doing that? I don't know. Let's see. We got some mutton, raw llama meat, raw llama meat, some leather, mutton. White llama fleece and brown llama fleece. Quick, how do you have a... Oh, shoot, we can't. We got a diamond from that zombie. Hmm. Well, you know what? We got a lot of loot. And, uh... Do we have a boat in our pocket? I thought we had a boat. Where's the boat? There it is. Let's, uh, let's grab the boat. You know, one thing I didn't try to do is right click on the llamas. Any creepers? Oh, that's right. They burn in daylight in this mod pack. Well, I, um, their old friend dog here, I got up early in the morning to do, um, Let's get into this water down here and take our boat for a ride. Are those donkeys over there? Let's go see. I got up early this morning to do meditation. I had a rough night again last night. Not as bad as the previous night. Those are old wolves. Um, woke up this morning. We had storm systems coming through this morning or last night. And um, I woke up and... Um, started meditating and very quickly very soon noticed I had troubles with my eye with my vision um, oh, I'm getting messages coming in incoming choppers I uh, thought maybe it was just a didn't know what to think it was. Just didn't really know what to think it was. Good heavens. A whole barrage of messages here. Um, and 
Diamond Girl, she just did you just level up Diamond Girl? From hitting some dirt. I don't think it's no, I don't think that's what it was. Um we got a emerald from what? Bones and an emerald. We passed by those those wolves. They were standing around a carcass. I wonder if they took out a skeleton of some kind during the night. Hmm. And our magnet just picked it up. Um, anyway, I noticed I was having vision problems. Even told Noy about this. She insisted I go see the eye doctor, which was just it was payback because I had um, given her the same lecture some weeks ago. Go see the eye doctor. Take care of your eyes. Yada yada. And um, anyway, after I shortly realized that the reason I was having trouble. Uh, seeing anything was because um, ginseng. ginseng. A great song, Ginseng Sullivan by Norman Blake. Um, I began to realize I was having a migraine, and uh, migraines cause all kinds of artifact issues with my vision. But the main one is that um, as I'm uh, just going about my day normally, I start getting a zigzag lightning bolt um, of rainbow scintillating colors directly in the center of my field of view. It's like a little curly hair right in front of my eyeballs, and um, I mean directly in the field of view, and it um, it when I have it. A migraine is coming. I don't always have it when I'm having a migraine, but I usually do. Uh, and when I do have that rainbow scintillation, uh, those things are called um, migraine aura, the aura effect of a migraine. Uh, and um, anytime I have that aura, it is a sure sign that a migraine is on the way. Diamond girl. Enjoy that. Just put some um, not silk touch. That would, that would not be good, but put um, some fortune on you, Diamond Girl, and you will be a mean green getting machine. Just making my way back, making my way down, to, making my way northward here to return to um, to the sea. I wonder if those llamas are going to attack. When llamas attack, season four, season one actually. Hydrangea, nice. I wish I knew why those dang llamas attacked me. Do I look like a a threat or something? I thought llamas were neutral. Hmm. Is it something? Is it something about the way I smell? Something I'm carrying? I don't know. But I'm still struggling with this migraine. So hope you forgive me. It causes all kinds of memory issues and. Um, cognition issues on top of my usual challenges. I had a um, conversation today with an old friend of mine, an old high school friend, football, high school football friend, American football. Um, and uh, one shot, one kill. Frank. Pig killing Frank. Da 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 da. Pig killer. Guess guess see. Frank, you're gonna get yourself a new nickname. You better, better mind your p's and q's there. Let's. Uh, we're getting 
it's getting ready for nighttime, so let's go down here and hunker down for the night by the pond, by the river. Actually, let's see if we can. Uh, okay, we tried to right click that and tried, just for grins, I tried to right click the squid to see if we could harvest anything with the clippers, the shears, and we got nothing, which is just as good because we got a full inventory. Let's sleep through night 171. Welcome, day 172. Day 172. Zucchini is eating. Oh, we need to get a bunch of stuff that's not yet eaten. Oh, leek is eaten. Zucchini is eaten. Celery is eaten. Kohlrabi, not yet eaten. Rutabaga and rye. Oof, raw pork. I don't think I want to eat those. Beans are eaten. Ginger is not yet eaten. Okay. All right. Rice is not yet eaten. Got a lot of things that are not yet eaten. Water chestnut, kale, jute. Jute. How do we eat jute? Spice leaf. What else is not yet eaten? Right, I've got rye in my inventory. Cotton. I don't think I want to eat cotton. Cabbage, really. Rutabaga. I've got one. Huckleberry. Interesting. Kohlrabi got one. Beet. Put that away. Turnip. White mushroom. Put that away. Okay. Uh, creeper oyster. <laughs> Not yet eaten. I'm pretty sure I don't want to eat creeper oyster. Broccoli is not yet eaten. Who wants? Man, I don't want to eat broccoli. No thanks. Raspberry not yet eaten. Okay. All right. Enough of that. Enough is that. Let's uh, let's make our way over here. How much of that coal do we got? Lots of coal. Everything's good. It's been a very productive trip. We looted a village, um, a, an old-fashioned village. Um, and hey, little pony. Hey, herd. Oh shoot! What time is it? Okay. I gotta, I gotta go out tonight. I gotta, unfortunately, even though I've got a migraine, I've got to get to the astronomy club meeting tonight to pay my um, star party fees. Probably leave here in about an hour. Goat weed. Pineapple. Like pineapple, Sumatra. I better check and see who this barrage of messages are from. More ginseng. Got it here, right? Ginseng. Ginseng is a remedy for um, supposedly a, a health, uh, great health benefits in ginseng. Uh, old American folklore, Southern folk folklore, talked about the benefits uh, of ginseng. Um, it's also used in Asian culture quite a lot. It's one of the ancient Chinese herbal remedies, ginseng. Uh, it's great. I mentioned earlier about the Norman Blake song, uh, Ginseng Sullivan. Great. One of his great original tunes of many. One among the many great Norman Blake tunes. Hey, chickens. Do I have I have feathers? You know what? So we can right click. 
chicken to get a to get a feather. Oh, more what two feathers? Now I'm told this does not harm the chicken, but obviously it does. They're down a half a heart, but it doesn't turn them hostile. Huh. Okay. All right, let's go check the. Oh yeah. Oh man, shaky. Let's go check my phone. I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. Oh man, my sis. Um, sis has my sis has been a long time migraine sufferer, and uh, she just sent back her notes about what she has to do for her migraines. She has it worse than I do. Full inventory. Can't really afford to get anything else. Mm. Although I could always just drag it around with me like I am now. You know, the other thing I remembered, I can just sprint and uh, it gives me a chance to consume some of these new foods, right? What could possibly go wrong? I mean, right? Look at that pond right to our left. It looks like a huh, looks like a cookie monster. A chicken. Look at a chicken. Or those aliens on Sesame Street. Yep, 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 yep. Uh, let's zoom out here. Let's uh, out, out. Oh, we just we need to go eastward. Well, this is good. We're getting some exploring in. I missed something to our left, to our to our right there. Hmm, missed a house. I'm a good mind to go down there and check it out. We can always come back up. Uh, it must be on the other side of this hill. That's why I missed it. It was up on the hill. Okay, let's check the map. Well, I see it on the mini map. I see nothing on the mini map. Are we really that far away? Journey, journey map, please. Oh, yeah. We're a long way, man. Okay, just cut straight across. Ah, oh, it was up on top of that bluff. That's why I missed it. thing uh, what else is going on um, oh because of the migraine I did something I, I, I very very rarely do uh, I ordered in pizza uh, and actually my favorite pizza which is um, Domino's thin crust I love their thin crust pizza Oh, that's one of those um, prefab brick houses things. We'll go check out the loot chest upstairs. Which, oops, which way is the door? She said, I'll give you a shelter from a storm. What do we got here? We got a magic book. Efficiency one. 
Nice. A couple of jungle saplings. Take those torches, just please. A bone. Anything I can stack. We don't want those stone tools. Although apple and bread. Yep, we got bread here. Can I stack the bones? I can. Bread. Yeah, it's fine. I'm not going to mess with it. What time is it going to be? 5.53. So we could sleep through the night. It's going to be close to night time, but... The door for the next person. Head... Northward. Head back to the north. Actually, northeast. Sun's going down. Oi. Well, I hope you are doing good today. Good today, good tonight, whatever time of day or night it is for you. Hope you have had a good day. As usual, so much is on my mind and I'm just trying to focus on, um, intentionally focusing on everything's coming around. Everything's going to be great gonna get what I want you're gonna get what you want we're all gonna get what we want we just have to believe in it believe in it man have faith in it trust in it somehow find a way to trust and uh, of course part of trusting welcome day 173 uh, part of trusting the trusting process is um, is acting on that my friend Noi had this, she calls herself Buddhist. She, she's a belie believer in Buddhist philosophy, which I admire very much. I admire, there's a lot about Buddhist philosophy I greatly admire. Um, she says she's not, many of the people around her, many of, um, many Thai people are, um, what would we call it? We would call it in Western culture. We would say that they're they worship, they're sort of almost like worshiping the Buddha, praying to the Buddha, the Buddha figure. Um, but really, more like the Catholic and its use of icons, the Catholic Church and its use of icons and praying to the praying to Mary and things like that. They pray to the Buddha figure, basically to intercede on their behalf and such. She says she doesn't believe in that and. Um, she doesn't believe in getting something for nothing, as she puts it. And um, I admire that belief as well. Let's see. I think we're going to go. This is correct, right? Yeah. Lag spike. This is correct. Um, she believes in working for what you get, not just receiving something just because you asked. And I, I agree with that. Although... I think when you want something, how to say this, one of the things I've learned in life is that when I want something, I have to say I want it. And if there's somebody who can grant it for me or give it to me, I have to ask for it. So I, it's a, to me it's an act, a positive, it's almost like um, Not exactly a courageous act, but I have to kind of go against my my skepticism or my condition, self-conditioning um, about not asking for what I want and just hoping I get it by accident. You know, so I, I think there's a lot to be said for focusing on what you want via whatever means of meditation, focus, prayer, intentionality, action, word, deed, um, whatever is available to us, you know, whatever it takes to bring that into, into fruition, into fruit. Oops, adjusting my mic here. Afraid my mic cord was a bit loose. Okay, let's zoom out. We should be... Uh, we are, we're going to 
I need to bear eastward. Talk about a little Gilligan's Island out here lost in the, by itself. Here, let's um, let's, let's let's help foster some life in this world. Oh, I can't plant those shoots. I could plant jungle saplings. An olive sapling. Ooh, I want to take that home. Hmm. Mm -hmm -hmm. Spruce. Plant these jungle saplings. Bring a little bit of life into this world. Any grass? Any flowers we got? A wind thistle. Let's plant some wind thistle. Mm. That's all I see. bringing a little bit of diversity to this island, I hope. Mm. Learned a lot in Thailand that makes me very humble. Um, people are very kind, even though they have very hard lives. And uh, to many of them, I'm wealthy beyond... Um, wealthy beyond fathomability, <laughs> beyond fathoming, um, a Westerner, American, um, privileged in that way, lucky to have grown up in America um, and have the means to travel to Thailand halfway around the world. So even, even so, um, very kind. Uh, even joking with me, one day I was, we were at the Sunday walking market in uh, Chiang Mai, and uh, Noi was, I had, get, Noi, she was looking out for me, she wanted me to make, to have the material I needed, the stuff I needed to have a st stress-free and worry-free meditation, and so I had all these um, uh, pants. I had like three pairs of pants and a shirt and uh, uh, some other stuff for myself, some chimes and a, a lamp kit and uh, some soap and uh, man, what else? Anyway, I had moments and then noise was shopping too. And so as I um, uh, made my way through the market, the very crowded market, and I was carrying some of Noise stuff along with my stuff. Efficiency one. I wonder if we could put that on Diamond Girl. I bet we can, huh? And I want to go scratch up some more levels too. Oops. What did I just do? I am not thinking that's the that's that that's where the migraine is. I think it's probably. It must be too expensive. Siphon, Luling, and Unbreaking Tree. Oh, poor me. Mm. So this guy, so I'm, I'm, I'm loaded down with bags so heavy I can hardly see beyond the bags. <laughs> and, and this guy, in, a, in one of the vending, small, tiny, little cramped vending stalls, he looks up at me, he smiles, and he says, Good shopping day, boss. And I look, I'm just, I can't slow down because she's hurrying along, but I look back at him and I, I'm smiling and I say, good shopping day. He laughs. <laughs> oh man, I'm like an American man and, and, and a, t oh, a horse hoof. Oh, gross. How did we get a horse hoof? Raw horse meat? I swear I did not attack a, 
the wolves must be attacking the horses or something. Oh my gosh. Somewhere I got horse parts. Maybe that's where that letter came from. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my freaking god. Ugh. That's kind of gross, isn't it? So I, um, People are so kind. Much to be thankful for. Let's see. Let's go collect some of that nether wart, by the way. First, ah, chickens. I did not right click a whole lot of chickens, did I? I'm afraid. Honestly, people, I'm afraid to go back to the nether. I'm afraid. Uh, that's not what I wanted to do. I'm not even thinking wither. Wither. We have one of those. Wither bone. Withered bone. Wither bone. Can be made with wither dust. Mm. Wither skeleton. What's it used on? Withered bone crook. Hmm. Well, that's interesting. Withered Armedian sword. Nether amethyst. Oh, that's very interesting. So, nether amethyst. Withered Armedian pickaxe and shovel. Ooh. That stuff looks like it should be much more powerful than that. Uh, durability 2250. Wither bone helmet. That stuff looks amazing. Unfortunately, it's not nearly as strong as diamond. Blazed wither bone, frosted wither bone. Blazed. Oh my goodness. This stuff is amazing. All right, enough of that. We're gonna be here all night. Oh, and it is speaking of night. It is night. Um, what did I do with my food? Oh, it's in my backpack. Well, on this note, folks, I am going to call this an episode. Thanks for joining me, and I'll be back with you another time for Minecraft Through the Night, Season 4, Introvert Island. See you.